My name is Eric Hammersand. I own the Dry Dock Waterfront Grill on Lombo Key. We're an upscale casual restaurant. Outdoor dining is extremely popular here in Florida and particularly in the Sarasota area. We have approximately 40 seats on our outdoor patio. But what we found with the Schwank heaters is we're able to utilize all of our tables on a more frequent basis using the heaters. Average ticket price is $20 per person. We typically will uh, seat the tables three to four times, both lunch and dinner. So the ability to have that kind of revenue that we otherwise wouldn't have with the heaters is very important to us. We found the aesthetics of the Schrank heaters to be uh, extremely good. We get a lot of guest comments about uh, the appearance of them, the fact they're located from the ceiling area. We did uh, get them done in stainless steel because we are out in the water, so uh, they've held up very well. Prior to using the Schwank heaters, uh, we had mushroom heaters located on our outdoor patio. Uh, the problems we experience with those are not nearly as effective heating the tables. It would typically heat one side of the table. Uh, the other issue we had is uh, guests trying to navigate and our servers trying to navigate around the, the bases of the heaters. So the Schwank heaters took away both of those negatives uh, by mounting them from the ceiling. The heat coming down is much more effective. Guests are much more comfortable with that system plus the fact that we have a lot more room between the tables because it's not being taken up by a mushroom stand-up heater. When I would work before with the old heaters, I was always bumping into them, and now I can just walk around the dining room much more conveniently than if the heaters were on the floor like they used to be. I love the new heaters. It allows me to carry trays and maneuver around the dining room, and it also allows me to wear shorts in 30-degree weather. The customers love the heaters. Whenever I have tables tell me that they're cold, I just run upstairs, flip on the switch, and it gets warm within seconds. Hi, I'm Lori, and I've lived in Florida for 15 years. From Cleveland originally, I've been to this restaurant since it opened, and I have to say that this is the most comfortable heater I've ever had outside. This is definitely the coldest day that I've ever been here, and I have to say the, uh, the heater is appropriate for the weather today, for sure. Yeah. Very comfortable. Um, it gets chilly here at night, often in the winter, and Floridians get cold easily. So this is a wonderful, wonderful thing. So the way we control these heaters here, uh, we have a control box up here. We have a number with each uh, heater, the way they work. It's, uh, we have a number one and a number two. Uh, the way we control it, we just press the number one. Uh, that's for uh, low. If they wanted something warmer or hotter, we'll just turn off the number two, and that's it. That's all it takes. The two-stage capability of the Schwank heater was one of the selling features uh, compared to, to other brands that we looked at. Having the ability to go from both low and a higher heat was very important to us. Uh, all guests are somewhat different, so some like a little lower heat, others like a higher heat. We've had them now going on two years and had absolutely no problems with them. I would definitely recommend uh, Schwank heaters. Having had the experience of using the stand-up mushroom heaters on the patio, versus the, the Schwank heaters, no comparison. Perfect, that's great, Eric. Okay, good. Awesome, thanks a lot, I appreciate yep. it. Well, it's all true. Yeah. So, you know, I don't that's have to make anything up. Yeah. I'll give this to you. Thanks.